in Italy where I started from. They were friends whom I, I used to pray with. They gathered 85 million and gave us the money which we used to buy this piece of land where we are. We are looking for funds to build it so that it becomes a hospitality center for the street children and the vulnerable. So where we can meet them, uh, you know, they have counseling services in Uganda. That's one of the biggest problems we have, that we have a bigger population without jobs. So many of these youth go on the streets to fend for themselves, to look for what to eat. But when they get on the streets, what they find is not actually a, a better life, but it's a very devastating life. Yes, we are arresting them. These injaga smokers and all these, because we are even suspecting them to have committed these offences, but we are not solving the major problem. I realize that when you take them to court, take them to prison, they reach there, find other criminals of actually bigger crimes, like capital offences. They reach there, there is an interaction. As they interact, they get more hardened. Now, they will serve their sentence, come back on the same street, because they don't have homes. Automatically, they will come back on the streets. But now they will be more hardened and they will commit more bigger crimes. We have had an, an interaction several times and uh, I think and I hope he's going to help us as security using this model to help reduce crime by taking away the street kids from town. <laughs> Fala yanga mwe muke tambure ngoku yatugambeire bagato yuti mwe muke tumurabe